Okay, we're ready for WOW lesson. It's good to see that you two brought your uh, proper tools. You both got your WOW words on front of you. Uh, welcome group three. Today we will be doing sort 17, vowel alternation, long to short. Uh, little Johnny, you've got my copy, so is it okay if I borrow that? I'll just bring it over here, and then we'll get started talking about it. Okay, this is going to be another one of those magic trick ones. Let me get my pointer here. And we've got long vowel to short vowel. Now, what the heck does that mean? But if we look at these words, please, then we add uh, the suffix to it, and it says pleasant. Did you hear a change in the vowel sound? Long E, please. Short E, pleasant. And I'm looking at the next one for mine. The base word being mine is, yes, little Johnny? Yeah, in uh, mine, the I makes a long sound like I. That's right. It's long I. But if we take this other word that comes from what do you get out of a mine? A mineral. What sound does the I make then? In, in mineral, the I makes the short I sound, I, mineral. Yes, Jenny. That's right, it makes a short I sound, so it goes from mine to mineral, and so on. If we take breathe, breath, but we add the E, and it's breathe. Take a breath. Breathe, I am breathing. But um, that's a noun, I can breathe to breath. Oh, sorry, from breath. Take a breath is a noun. To breathe, which is a verb. Now I ask, is that going to always change? Is it, they're always going to be like noun to verb, verb to adjective? Um, let's just check out a few. If you're an athlete, it is noun. But if you're athletic, it's an adjective. So that didn't work. And what about if you're human? Uh, that means you're a person. Well, I have humane. And then I have humanity. A humane person is kind to animals. And that's an adjective. Humanity is a noun. But what you're going to find out is it just goes from a, and it's not something that you can depend on what type of word, noun, verb, adjective, noun to verb. So the main point is to really pay attention to the vowels. Crime. And who commits a crime? A criminal. Notice how the long I changes to a short I. So let's take a look at the uh, generalization. Well, I'm just going to borrow the book from you, Jenny, if you don't mind. Thank you. And here's going to be the generalization for vowel alternation. Adding suffixes to base word often changes the pronunciation of the vowel within the base word. From a long vowel to a short vowel and vice versa. That's the generalization. Okay, good luck.